Question 15 reads, the cube shown above has edges of length 2, and A and B are the midpoints of two of the edges. What is the length of the line segment AB? Let's start this problem off by drawing this line segment that we're interested in, AB. So it's going to extend from A over to B through the space of the cube. Now in order to find the, uh, the distance of this line, I'm going to draw a triangle that has this line as the hypotenuse. This is going to be one of its legs, and the other leg is going to be this direction right here on the face of the cube. And this is a right angle. So that's the first triangle I'm going to draw. Let's fill in what we know about this triangle. So for this leg, if this length is 2, right, the side length of the cube is 2, and this will be half of it, 1. The hypotenuse is the thing that we're interested in solving for, and we don't know this other leg either. So we have to even, we have to work another step back and try to solve for this other leg before we can solve for the hypotenuse of that triangle, which is what we're ultimately interested in. This one's a little easier to see. This leg that we're interested in is the hypotenuse of a second right triangle, this one. This one just lies right on the face where point B is. Okay, so what do we know about this triangle? Well, it has a length of 2 for this leg because it's just right along the side. And then from the bottom to B, that's 1. So we can solve for this hypotenuse. We'll just use the Pythagorean theorem. So the thing we're interested in is going to be 2 squared plus 1 squared is equal to 5. And then don't forget to find the length. We'll take the square root of that. So the square root of 5 is this length here. Now we have all the information that we need to solve for that unknown value of distance between A and B. We'll just use the Pythagorean theorem again. So that unknown distance, x squared, is equal to 1 squared plus the square root of 5 squared. So x squared is equal to 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. So the distance that we're looking for is equal to the square root of 6. And that's the correct answer, D, square root of 6.